U.S. Presidential Inauguration It is hard to dimension and to explain the challenging aspects that are going to be active the day of the presidential inauguration. From the out-of-control violence that this energy can be manifested into, to the bad mood that will affect most of the country and probably also abroad. The astrological aspects for this day is not something that happens very often, moreover, is a rare occurrence. Last month we posted an article referring to the solar eclipse of December 14th and how that affected the US natal chart. The following is included in that posting. The eclipse opposes Mars and squares Neptune on the United States chart. Mars speaks of the armed forces, war, conflicts and fire. By being in House 7 of the associations, it gives the United States a power to set the conditions with its allies. Mars is an energy that does not negotiate, it imposes. Since the eclipse is in house I, which in the country is represented as the self, the identity, identifying with being what one is, speaks of a conflict with allies due to conflicting interests, which can easily lead to an armed conflict. It sounds as if the United States has the need to assert itself in its position, and show what the country is, and these actions are been opposed by its allies. Natal Neptune in House 9, speaks of the high ideals that the United States can have and profess. House 9 also has to do with other countries and justice. By squaring the eclipse, it could mean several things. The first is that, by the actions taken, it breaks with the principles, identity and ideology that the country had until now, or on the other hand, that government says one thing and then does something completely different. The legality of what can be done will be questioned. This could happen internally within the US as well as with other countries. Another possibility is that, this square could also refer to that the United States has been forced to do something that is completely out of its policy and philosophy. One component of the solar eclipse is that it already contains a square with Neptune, and this is a factor that affects globally, which may indicate that the virus problem worsens, that vaccines do not work, or simply that another virus comes out, or a new version of the one that is currently active shows up. For the particular case of the United States, this eclipse activates the Neptune-Neptune opposition, which is present today and will become exact in May 2021. An opposition between House 3, communication, short trips, and relationship with neighboring countries, and House 9, of abroad, justice and high philosophies and ideals, speaks of a breakdown in these aspects. It could be that other countries deceive the US with their actions, they agree on one thing, and then they do different. The energy of the eclipse can manifest itself as a transit. So events can materialize anytime around the date of the eclipse, until six months after. That is, until mid-2021. Taking the aspects of the inauguration in addition to the energy active by December's eclipse is too much conflicting energy present. The outlet of that energy can lead to internal conflicts in the US as well as abroad. Social mood and confidence can be affected in a negative way and stocks can pay the price of this situation. All-time's high trend can be followed by an all-time low crash. Therefore, it should not come as a surprise if an armed conflict starts abroad, and or people fighting on the streets throughout the US, and a meltdown of the financial markets happen. Thank you for your visit. You can subscribe to our channel or to our blog at www.thenewroad.com.